This episode This episode of Sesame Street is brought to you by cigarettes, weed, energy drinks, and coffee. I've been leaving, living at the studio. I sing from about noon to about 11 o'clock at fucking night, which is ridiculous. We just thought of this idea on totally, I'm creating a chamber of fucking ill for him to sing into. <laughs> I'm gonna stick his mic in there, I'm gonna make him push his face into it. Like we were just toying around with, you know, how he sings and what what makes him do what he does and his whole feel and his body stance and 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 how and just just the the mentality of the fucking you know the distortion fucking dynamic monster vocal and how it's done and we just thought of this idea on I know it's gonna be sick. Think of how filthy of an industry it is, dude. It's I know, it's fucked. But fuck man, it's so huge, and it's always been so huge for fucking hundreds of years. Yep. Can't can't fuck with that. Guy is farting in girl's mouth. <laughs> Look at the ball. She's like, <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> there, she starts puking a lot, <laughs> and she just runs in the bathroom, locks herself in the bathroom, and you're just like, what the fuck? All right. I think this song is done. What's this? Definitely super, super, super excited about this record. Uh, we're doing it with Machine was a good idea because he's insane and he gets us. And his ideas with our music were ideas we have had, just were never able to actually compile to the music and put to the music. So just now that it's there, it's it's it's, 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 it's in a whole new way. It's definitely the worst sushi I've ever had in my life. By worst, I mean the greatest. The greatest sushi extravaganza. That way that fish is breathing is the way I feel. He's like, oh, oh look at me. Oh, oh, look at his lungs. Like, oh. Let me go ahead and get in here. You could be the big spoon. Hi, cutie. Are you really drunk right now? No. Are you on marijuana pots? Yeah. yeah, you're really high. You like marijuana. Is it good for you? Don't touch your beard. The past month has pretty much been these guys crashing at my house at night after they get out of the studio. This is what rock and roll is really like, folks. Like that. Captain Caveman on crack cocaine. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking grown ass metal dudes working and smelling like shit in my house for a month. I don't think Mark has ever used deodorant once in his life. <laughs> Wait, I got a good story for your fucking DVD. Wait, what happens next? So one night, I come in the fucking house, right? And I was yelling at Mark in the bedroom. So now, he's pretty obliterated. So I close the door and I walk out, and then I come back in and I yell again, and I close the door and I leave, and I come back in, and Mark has his mangina penis flapping back, butt naked in about 30 seconds <laughs> waving his dick at me and going <laughs> <laughs> that's what my house has been like for a fucking month <laughs> 